In the realm of celestial beauty and earthly allure, Paradise by Harry Met de Bulls stands as a testament to the harmonious dance between divine creation and human fallibility. Crafted meticulously between c. 1541, c. 1550, this tondo encapsulates the biblical narrative of Genesis with an artistic finesse that transcends time. The artwork is a symphony of elements, each playing its part in narrating the tale of Adam and Eve amidst the backdrop of paradise. The fountain, resplendent and grandiose, emerges as a symbol of life's genesis, an oasis from which existence springs forth. Two spheres encircle this earthly paradise, they are silent witnesses to God's magnificent creation and mankind's impending fall from grace. The outer sphere, dark green in hue, embodies the world sea, a nod to the initial void before creation, Genesis 1 verse 2. In contrast, the inner sphere illuminates God's majestic work on the fourth day when he birthed sun, moon, and stars into existence, Genesis 1 verses 14 to 19. Bull's inspiration draws from the creation of the world by Master M.S. in Luther's Bible of 1534 but deviates to incorporate explicit depictions of the fall of man. This divergence enriches his artwork with layers that invite viewers into a deeper contemplation on humanity's dual nature. Every detail is meticulously crafted, from animals roaming freely in Eden to scenes depicting God forbidding Adam, Genesis 2 verses 15 to 17, the creation of Eve, Genesis 2 verses 21 to 22, the fall, Genesis 3 verses 1 to 7, and their subsequent expulsion from paradise, Genesis 3 verses 22 to 24. These biblical episodes are woven seamlessly into an idyllic landscape that juxtaposes cultivated fields against wild nature. Yet amidst this heavenly depiction lurks an ominous foreshadowing hostility between animals alluding to mankind's imminent fall from grace. It is this intricate dance between divine beauty and human imperfection that elevates paradise beyond mere visual artistry into a profound narrative echoing through ages. Paul's masterpiece isn't just an artistic expression but also serves as a philosophical exploration inviting viewers on a journey through heaven's serene landscapes while silently whispering about Earth's tumultuous terrains awaiting post-fall humanity.